What is up guys, Drudo Brito here, and we are back once again with Le Let's Play Legend of Zelda Majora's Mask. And in the last episode, we, um, well, hold on, let me turn down my TV. We did some random stuff, we probably, oh yeah, we went to the Iconic Graveyard. In this episode, we're actually gonna head over to, uh, the, um, Great Bay Coast. We're gonna finally head over there, so, um, I guess we're just gonna go to the, let's see, is it west or the east? I don't even remember. I think it's west. I don't, I don't know. I'm just gonna go to the west. If it's not, then I can, I mean, it's not that big of a deal, obviously. I can easily just, you know, go back. Actually, let's um, do this. This is a lot faster. So yeah, we're gonna finally go to Great Bay Coast, and this is my favorite area. I, okay, I know I said that Snow Hut is my favorite, but when I really think about it, this is just my favorite area, and it kind of depends on the mood I'm in also. So, um, yeah, and right now I'm really feeling, uh, oh, why did I just play that song? I meant to play Pona's song. But yeah, now I'm really feeling, um, the Great Bay Coast, maybe because it's summer and I'm, um, you know, go to the beach. Not in real life, but in the game. Okay, well, what is the opponent song? There it is. Okay, that's what I thought. So, yeah. I'm gonna just wait for. Pona, where. Really? Where is he? Dude. Oh my god. Yeah, that's kind of annoying. Every once in a while you'll play the song and then opponents will be like nowhere in sight. Oh, here. Here she is. Alright, let's go. Go. Dude, that's not... You run, Stop running against the wall, you're an idiot. Okay. Go ahead and you want to jump this. Barely make that. And then, head on through. And welcome to... Great Bay Coast. Okay, if it's not going to tell me the name, I might as well just go ahead and say it. There it is, Great Big Host. And right off the bat, we see um, something going on in the middle of the ocean. You saw those seagulls there. What do you say we go check that out? You know, because where there's seagulls, there's always something important, and at least in Zelda games. So let's go check that out. And uh, yeah, look! Oh my God, it's a guy. It's a white guy. Oh. Somebody, oh please, get me like a somebody. Too sure. I, you know, I had to do that. I had to say that. Okay, dude, grab him. What are you doing? Oh wait, is, am I pushing him or not? I can't even tell. This is like the worst camera angle in the history of camera angles. Okay, well I think I'm. Yeah, I'm pushing him. <laughs> All right, come on. There we go. What is wrong with this guy? Look at all these tattoos. Okay, honestly, why do they make cutscenes this long? Do they have to, like, make it as slow as they possibly could just to emphasize the pain he's going through or whatever? I don't know. Ugh, I am Macau of the Zora people, guitarist in the Zora band. I think this is it for me, my final message. Yeah, I'll listen, whatever. If I don't listen, I'm pretty sure he just walks away, or doesn't walk away, but he just ignores you or something like that. One, two, three. Oh, baby, baby, listen to me. Carnival's beginning soon. We're the ones we're waiting to see. <coughs> but that girl, a vocalist. She laid some strange eggs, and she's lost her voice. Didn't get the last part. Whoa, I'm Great Bay. And Great Bay now. Something is uh, happening. Is it now? Oh, baby, listen to me. I don't want to beg Gerudo Pirates. They stole that girl's eggs. Once stop the Gerudo Pirates, then pow and bam. I got knocked down, and here I am. What do you mean? They shot you out of a cannon or something? How'd you end up in the middle of the ocean? I don't see any, like, I don't know. Somebody, please rescue her eggs. Blah, 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 heal my soul. Okay. And he's dead. Okay, so get out your Ocarina. And that's... There, wait, what? That, oh, that is, the, okay, that's, that is the song, Healing. Okay, I thought I played it wrong. And we're gonna heal his soul, just like you said, with the song of healing. Quite literally, we're gonna heal his soul. Dude, okay, if, if you're gonna have textures this bad, don't zoom in that far, that's just creepy. Like, don't zoom into his eyes. 
especially on like an N64 like console, because that's just creepy. Okay, it's advice to any of you making an N64 game, but just no one. But still. Okay, this is just weird. Oh, oh, oh it was sideways. Okay. <laughs> And there's his band. Look at that big fat drummer over on the right. Okay, so that's it. I bet you can guess what's gonna happen now. His body disappears and only his face is left. What can we do with his face, you ask? Well, we can put it up above our heads and take it as a battle trophy. First of all, you get because and call it a Zora mask to make it seem a lot less um. Let's see here, yeah. and that's kind of creepy. His spirit's still there playing the guitar. Wow. Anyways, what we do with this mask? Okay, dude, can you stop cutting cutting me off? I kind of want to like. Jesus, man. Okay. Oh, poor Link is crying. Well, we can put the mask on, put it over our face, and we become Azora. Now, the Zora form is definitely my favorite form. The Goron form is also pretty good, but I mean, honestly, this is like an amazing form. I mean, let me just show you this. Look, we, look what you can do with the Zora, and where the water, um, the water kills the Goron. Um. The Zora can just swim through like super fast. It's so cool. That's why I love the uh, swimming in this game. It's so good. So yeah, first thing we're gonna do is uh, hit this little owl statue here, or you can save your game if you really want to, but mainly because it's a warp. Let's see if I can hit the tingle guy from here. I probably can't. Yeah. Okay. Didn't think so. Um. Let's see. I don't have any arrows. That's great. Well, it looks like we're looks like we're using the Deku form. Never thought I'd use it. Use this. No, never thought I'd use this again. I can't even reach it, can I? Okay, I guess if I go up the ladder, I can. Oh, what, 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 dude? Why'd you do that? Okay. I actually climbed the ladder. And yeah, if you recognize this, this is a uh, Super Smash Brothers melee um, stage. So yeah, pretty pretty um, bad stage, if you ask me. But hey, whatever. I actually haven't played any Super Smash Bros. game in a long time. The like long okay. Why can I not hit this guy? Do I do I need arrows? Cause I can like go get. I, I might just get this later, but yeah, I'm just gonna get this later. We don't need to do this now, anyways. For now, what we're gonna do is we're gonna head over to the Pirate Bay. Um, I think that's what it's called, Pirate Bay. No, Pirate's Fortress. Okay, so it is not a um, it's not a torrent website. It's a Pirate Fortress. Okay, that makes sense. A little more sense than Pirate Bay. Just gonna head on over here. And let's see if I'm going. Nope, it's not there. It's, it might be over this way. Just gonna head on over here. There it is. Okay, I think it's this one on the right. You wanna keep swimming and then uh, slam into this thing right here and then reveal a little hole, go through it. And welcome to the Pirate Fortress. Now. This place will is made like so much easier if you have the stone mask. Put it on, and the guards will never see you. Now, um, one thing we you want to make sure you do while you, while you're here is actually get a picture of one of these guards because uh, it'll come in handy later. Because uh, some some guy later on in the game decides he wants to have a little fun time with a picture of the guards, and um, he can only do it. Um, and then he will um, trade a picture of the guards in exchange for something. So yeah, Let's see, Let's get a picture of the face. I guess that's perfect. And hey, wait, that's better. Okay. And after you've done that, I just want to wait a little bit for this boat, and then we're gonna head on in there. That's what we're gonna be tackling. Uh, I don't know how much we're gonna get into this in this episode though, because I'm up to about ten minutes almost. But for now, we're just gonna jump off the ship. And head on up this way. Now this, this, um, of all the memories I have of this game, 
Uh, I and again, I know I said that this is probably the same thing about um, Snowhead, but of all the memories I have of this game, this is one of the best. Just playing playing this part because I remember um, playing this with my cousins, and we couldn't figure out like how to get through this place. We were just stuck on it like all day, and then we like got up the next morning and went back to play it again, and it was just it's great. Uh, this game is awesome. So um yeah that I um. Yeah, that, just because of that, I mean, it's just this whole place is just amazing to me. My Probably my favorite area in the game. And I, oh my god, that's the third time I've said that. But, uh, my, it's my favorite side area. Even though it's not really a side area. It's my favorite, like, non-main area, if that makes sense, which probably doesn't. Anyways, oh look, it's fish. Oh look, the fish swim away when you, um, when you get close to them. Huh, that's weird. I thought Call of Duty Ghost was gonna be the first um, video game like producer ever to add that feature to their game, but I guess not. Escape came out in the year 2000, and it still uh, had that. Okay, hit the fucking thing! Holy god, dude, are you stupid? How can you not hit that? Okay, take it slow. Bam. Okay, there we go. That's a lot better. Can't grab the block. Push it. I don't think I need to push it all the way. Hopefully I'm even going- oh wait. I think I screwed up already. Oh no, I know I didn't, I just gotta do this. Push this back. And then go back, okay. Like this. Oh, I gotta love this song, this song is awesome. Do not go, um... Oh wait, I screwed up, yeah, I didn't screw up. Or did I screw up? I don't think we're. I don't think we want to go that way, do we? Yeah. I think if you go in there, then it just takes you to like it takes you back to the outside. Um, I think I don't know. And I don't even know if I'm going the right way. Yep, I just went in a circle. How, okay, this is the first room. How am I getting lost in the first room? Okay, just sit back and um, let's try and find out where I'm trying to get to. First of all, we came from there, right? So where's the exit? It's not going to be back there, is it? Uh, well, that, this is an awkward situation because I have, I'm have, i lost. I'm so confused right now. We came from there. Maybe we're, we are supposed to go through the uh, through there. Let me just see. And if <laughs> I'm probably being stupid, but hey. No, I'm like sure that takes you back to the beginning. Uh, YOLO. Where am I? Oh, that, okay, that was the right way. Okay, good. So, um, yeah. And that's what you gotta avoid. Those things that we that I just passed by. That I, you, you have to avoid those. Because they will shoot you out of, and they will take you back to the beginning. That's what I was thinking of, I guess. Go ahead and go down here. Oh, and I think we can get a heart piece in this room. Yeah, right there. Uh... See, how do we acquire that heart piece? Well, that is a very good question that you ask, and I'm glad that you can ask these questions because, well, I think there's a switch back here. Yes, there is. And you gotta press that, and then roll as fast as you can into the uh, the cage and collect the heart piece. For number 22, heart piece number 22 for us. That's always nice. Okay, gonna go on up here. Turn into Azora. And whoops. Go ahead and throw your little boomerang, whatever. Oh wow, that actually hit it. Nice. Throw over there, then run down, and that cage closes fast, so you're gonna wanna like hurry. Oh well I made it plenty of time, okay. Maybe not. Avoid that. Again, avoid that thing. And then here's the ladder, which we can climb up. Uh, I think I'm gonna end the episode as soon as I get up on top of this. Yeah, I am, because we're up to 15 minutes, almost. So in the next episode, we're gonna continue this place, probably finish it. Well, maybe not. We'll see. See you guys then.